mimi nilisikia tu ba unasikengelea design sana nasema na una stars mimi niliona hizo stars damu ilikuwa inamsplashia hivi hizo pieces moja ikaanguka ikagonga tv zingine zikaanguka zikapavunjika vunjika into pieces sasa hiyo sasa nishaanguka niko chini ameshika piece hivi anataka kunidunga sasa so ile tema amenielekea hivi damu ika splash once so ikamchapa uso i think ali freak out sasa akaniokota akaniekelea kwa kiti alikuwa na shake paka i could feel his hands alikuwa na shake mwanzo nilikuwa nakufa nilikuwa naambia tu god kani leo sawa wam poto welcome this is toxic boyfriends this is a show where i sit with ladies and gentlemen and we talk about their toxic partners that they've had in their lifetime this show aims at inspiring and also educating and enlightening the toxic situations that different people can be in with or without knowing so watch it learn and maybe you might not fall into a similar situation for this episode we have uh, madam smile <laughs> <laughs> Hey mama Masi. You're good? Yeah. You know I knew you were coming nikasema waindre hapa sweet rose ikwaje? Ina slap nzuri. Ina slap eh? Yeah. Hey. Eh lakini isika boyfriend. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Wrong joke guys. Guys, I'm just trying to. Anyhow, so I decided to give you some sweet rose hapa uh, for you. They are from Tanzania eh. Dompo nini? Dompo wines. Iko 10% alcohol eh. Mm -hmm. You know if I gave you this one, so we have e alta wine. This one he after wine 18%. Hii nikikupea hata we will not talk about your toxic boyfriend. Hii utanga. <laughs> so in your marination. In your woes. So when you are crying ni nini unapiga hapo light okay? Mm -hmm. Sasa karibu toxic boyfriends. So are we ready to now share the conversation? We yeah. talk about him eh. Nakuanga ready kila siku. Nakuanga ready kila siku. Uh -huh. Karibu sana hapa ni Mr. Walk. This is our house bar. This is the only barman who <laughs> is allowed. <laughs> mm. Eh kadompo kangu kasafi. As you continue. Anywho, karibu. So let's talk about him. Let's not waste any time. Tell me where you met this man. Do we say his name? No. We don't say his name. No. You want to protect him. Acha kwetu anonymous when you anamjua wamjue. He gave you this cut. And another one here. This cut here is the one who gave you. Yeah, I have these are 42 stitches. 42 stitches. Yeah. And then another one? Okay. Yes, you can show us on the shoulder. Is it uh, no, it's okay. You can see. It's here. Oh, this one. Yeah. Also up under your rasta. How many years were you with this guy? Um, five years. You were together for five years? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's start from the beginning. Before it got to all this physical, I mean, 42, 42 stitches. Mm. Wow. And you forgave him? Hakuna mali ulimpeleka? Nilichukua pitri, nikajaza, and I, I still have it. Pakasai. I still have the OB number. But at that time, I didn't feel it was the best thing to do. I knew there was a solution to this. And the fact that I suffered the whole of 2018, it's been four years. He saw the son, I think, last month, after four years. You guys have a son together? Yeah. Okay, pause on it. Let's rewind from the beginning. So to whenever your story leenda. First quick and in a hurry. Which year did you meet, Ama? Where did you meet? Tuanzia Huko. 2013, Sizzling. I met him through a friend. Okay. Akatubaya Pilao Pale Sizzling. Akabai Pilao in a sizzle, sizzle. I mean, you can't make a whole day, you can't make a So, if you go to Jamaica, I say, no. I don't know. I don't know. Wait, you've gone with a friend? Yeah. To see this man? Yeah. The man sees you? Akambia huyo msichana wewe sasa ufiki bei. Nipenda mbaya beshtako. Oh! And you could not see the signs? No. <laughs> <laughs> so, akapeo, beshtako also gave him the number? Eh, yeah, 
Nikapea namba. Kwani besti yako pia? Oh, okay. The It's... lady wasn't interested because aliona ni kama kuna venye ya rhyme. Oh, they were not rhyming but you were rhyming. <laughs> you looked like a potential punching bag. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, sorry. <laughs> Anywho. Namba ikapeanwa. Eh eh. That was it. Tukaanza ku vibe. Eh eh. Then came my 20th birthday. Eh eh. Jamaa akatengeneza sherehe ingine legend hapo Rongai. Ukaingia huko. Kapiga sherehe. Uko tu above the head. Muko tu above sherehe eh eh. Sasa I don't know what happened. I think Pitu ni scam or something. It didn't work for me. Oh, so ali piga. You took Pitu. <laughs> Kakata. But chukua P3. Ah, <laughs> okay. So you took P2? It didn't work. Backfired. Mm. Got pregnant. Yes. This immediately on your birthday. On my 20th birthday. This after you had known him for how long? Like let's say like two months. You knew him for two months uka peana <laughs> Garden of Eden. Na sasa hiyo mamangu alikuwa against your birthday ako like hakuna unaenda kufanya nini? Nikasema wewe enda lakini urudi lakini sasa utarudi aje it was immediately after high school Wow yeah. This is like your first love Not even I think the second Oh so it's not the one who broke no. your virginity okay So on your birthday is after high school you've gone to sherehe so your birthday akakuchipo mm. Nayo nayo kabisa Stima Before you know it And nilikuja kujua after two months Kitungu ina pick huko mm -mm. You're like, hey, kitungu, you know, 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 you you've just finished high school. Eh. I didn't have an option so nikaenda my mom hako nataka kuniona so Your mom also stays in Rongai No my mom all the time to kwa tunaishi pale Garden Estate Oh so from Garden Estate to Rongai yeah, The boyfriend Rongai. lives where Rongai Where from Garden Estate to eh when you love <laughs> Okay anywho eh uh -huh. So nikaenda life started You are there mpaka to his place mm. Have been told to bring to the so owner Sasa do si alikuwa hapa na ningojea He's like baby come let's move in. Kasama wewe ni mkubwa. Alipigia mamangu sima kwambia she's not under 18 na kuna ID so si mtoto. How old is the guy? I think right now he's around 36 or 37. That time how old was he? Ah uh, 30 I think 32. He was 32 and you were 18. I was 20. You were 20. Yeah. Okay. 12 year gap. Mm -hmm. You get there he's living in Rongai. Where does he work? Or does it work? He's a business person. Okay. Mm -hmm. How big was the house? I bed sitter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you move into a bed sitter. Maisha ikanza. Maisha ikanza. Mapenzi. New baby is coming. Of course. At first ilikuwa fiti. Later ya shule ikakamu nilikuwa nimepita. So nilikuwa naingia kampo. Okay. Nika ingia intekia jan. Mimi okay. na mtoto wangu tukasonga. Which kampo? Nilikuwa Masaimara Narok. Masaimara Narok inside. Mm-hmm. Okay. So nikaenda nikaingia shule na mtu wewe. So hiyo time alikuwa na cheat sana. And mimi nilikuwa na poa tu info na maniba. So one one of this time wakaniambia eh hey, itabidi ukuje ujione usisamenge tunakwambianga tu. So okay. I walk in in the morning. So you left Masaimara? Mm, katoka man, katoka Naro kwa asubuhi nikafika huko kitu 8 with the baby. Mm. It was true ni nilipata mademo kwa kwa hao. And that was it. Madam, what do you mean, madam? Si wali wa madam wawili. In a bed sitter? Yes. Okay, where did they... Okay, okay. I'll, I'll think about the space, but it's okay. <laughs> si kuna bed, si wanalala watatu. Okay. Mm -hmm. Aya, so you knock the door? Ah, ah. Nilifungu, window yiko imefungwa, so I peeped through the window. Kwe na mtoto? Ah, yeah, nilikuwa nasikia kama na cheese. It was... It was so bad, because I was this naive kid, so nilikuwa like, what do I do? You are in love. Of course I was in love because sina option mother ame sema hataki kukuona what do you do so unakufa kupona tu inside Who's paying your campus? My family does. My family was doing it that time. Okay. So ikafika mali akaambiwa achip in. Ah uh ah -uh, you wait. You peep through the window. Yes. And then? Si I saw them. And then? Si alikuwa amelala katikati. And then did you enter? Did you walk out? Did no, you I shout? Didn't. Did I, you? I just called the mom. 
So you peep, you see, you walked away. Call the mom. Mm -hmm. I've seen your son sleeping we between. Kuja. We need to talk. Okay. So and also call the landlord. Landlord alikuwa teacher wake wa primary. So alikuwa namjua. So the landlady, eh, akakuja. Eh, eh. So si akaulizo, what is this now? So, mimi nikaisha tu. You went back to Narok. Mm, karudi shule, shule, shule kafungwa nikaenda home. Kwetu ni Moise Bridge. So you didn't come back to mom? No. You went to grandma? Mm, kwetu shago. Okay. How big is the baby now? Eight years. Okay. Yes. So fast forward, nikona hii relationship is not working for me because zile tema liambua nilipie fees. Kila say Mr. Enda uza gas ulipie school fees, mara uza phone, mara uza laptop, nikona hii ni bullshit. And my family was like, no, me have been brought up by my grandpa, niya mekua kini shugulikia all my life. So ako like, this is a no. Ata usi jaribu kufikiri yako mleta hapa. From the word go is a no. Mtoto tutalea lakini huyu, no. So hili kwa relationship, my family was not for it. So ni kasema sawa, ni kutoka, how do I get it? So the first time, I can lose job yake. That is the first time, I think, that is the first time I'll wine slap. Na li ni slap tukiwa kwao. So tulikuwa tumetutukua tumehamaronga, tukenda kitengela. So life haka kwasa job, mili kwa badio shule, nikarubdi kwao. Tukwa kana kapo kwa mamake. So this time I tell him I need to go home, kwa zizi kawuku sana. Kwa likuweze nana mtoto wangu. So we start arguing. The next thing haka ni slap. That was the first time he slapped me. So na mzamoru na nigonga. And then lao place wana ishi ilikuwa like it's a gate of land ya hapo. So wana nishapa mbele ya wase and my kid was there. That is the first time, I think my kid was, was four that time. That is three actually, he was three. Mtu iwangu alichukua mawe ya kamgonga. And he was just a young baby. He didn't even know what was happening, but he could see an any attack. Let me defend mom. Yes. Nikaisha hivyo, nikatoka, nikachukua mtu hivyo, tukaishia. Kunyua, kunyua kitu, kunyua kitu, kunyua kitu, we? Piga flash, piga flash kitu at least, we? Slapped you in front of people. Eh, haka nigonga mapu. Nikagwanga kofi hapo mateke. Na badu nile msamea. Ok, why was he beating you? Siju nime sama nataka kuenda huo mna mtoi ya kaniliza kani likuja kwa kena mtoto. So I left. Mi nkaisha nikenda. I went to my auntie's kawa west. With the toy? Nikakauko for a while. After some time, of course, nikabimbelezo wa nikarudi. Tukaka. The second time, tuju tukaulizana, nintena haka nigonga. Mamangu haka niambia, unajua nini? Inanzanga na kofi moja. Iyo ni kofi yapi? Ya. Ya tatu, haita kwa fiti. Toka. Nakambia mamu, wapana, alisema na change. Mamu wako lakewa wana change. The flag is in your face like this is red. Manzia, uo, nisi uko in love. Red is your favorite color. Wizi ona. Uko like, oh, Aki, ame sautu mkona yake on my face, but it's not him. It's not like him. He will not do it again. He has promised. Yeah, he promised. Na seo ni kona audacity, ukisike vena mdefend. Apana, wee, wee. Hadi tunakosana na wawo vile unamdefend hapa. Seo kikumbuka, se Mr. Itaanza uambuwa uze phone ama laptop ulipe fees. Unachoka times 10. Basi sa utadu. So he's beaten you the second time? Yes. The third time, ni fourth year. Niko in my last semester. Si, hii date manzi si jayi sahao. It was 25th February. Mtu ya nagongwa na gari, then they lie to me. So I, nikasema wacha, I called home. Wait, pause, hold up. You are in Narok? Yes. With your baby? Mbebe ya likuwa home, nikuwa nisha muwacha sasa. So Moise Bridge? No, ni likuwa uko, kwa uni rongang. Oh, the baby is with him? With the parent, with the mother. With his parents? Yeah. Mtoto wakagongwa na gari? Mm-hmm. You are called? No, they didn't call me. I was called by a neighbor. So what did the neighbor tell you? I can't remember. I'm trying to call my gongo na gari na me pele kwa hosi ng kolek. Miss Jambiwa. So I call him. I kolek. I'm trying to me po ampaka script. Ukiulizo wa sema uliangu koko kende shata ya. So I call them. Even do anani ame. Ukiulizo. Bimfara. Hmm. Trying anani be the same thing. You tell me I'm going five years. I'm trying to mama. Bimfara. So when I say I'm apana, I called home. I'm trying to What do you think? Ni ande ni kambo a chana na awa deal na awa ni kona apana. Sisi bumiya. Asubui ni kamu kai zikoch mi mi oyo ni shafi kamu. Kaenda. So I took my son. Akona bandage kwa mbuna mza. Dila nini ulifanya? Mbuna mbio kweli. 
So I take him to a shop and buy a suit. Yeah, pack and buy. Nili bongo na dar na pale. Nili kwa nende a chumvi. So I'm like, how do you even send a five years old kid a kanunu a chumvi? Kwa ni yaku kwa namtu mungi na kwen. Uh huh. So you call him. You tell him I'm in the house. Akakuja. Okay. Akanembia kamasu ne zonge a padai. Cause I'm a busy job. Okay. Nika mambia sawa kaenda. So ni kajua standa takuchi lukam. So a friend of mine akakam. Kapiga story, ni kamsi ni kiza akakuwa mifika. So we didn't talk. Ni lala kwa bed, akalala kwa kiti. The next day in the morning, ni kambia na fa kwenda, ju ni kona class. Ni kona class afternoon. Ni kambia na fa kwenda, ju ni kona class. Kambia sawa ni telephone ni ako. Ni kambia phone yangu medu. Ati ni pati yoy phone. You told him. Yeah. Give me your phone. He, no, he wanted my phone. Oh, he's the one. He wants your phone. Yes. Okay. So I tell him, whatever is in this phone, it will hurt too. So leave my phone alone. <laughs> okay, so, this is getting interesting. So I feel like, okay, I need to see this. We come here. Mombasa now. We are going for my birthday. Mombasa, your time. Okay. Trying to solve things. I work. Okay. So, kumbi yo time yo te tukua uko alikuwa na snoop phone yangu, ni kilala na sikuwa na jua. So, kuna whatever alikuwa meona. Nipe simu, siku pay. Una Wait. Unanipe au nipei. You are, you are cheating on him. Me, I was not cheating. Me, nipa nisha move on. Oh, you had already exited the relationship. Of course, me, nipambia, it doesn't work. In you had told him? Yeah, he knew. But you are in Mombasa with him? Yes, to try and talk things out. Sleeping in the same bed. Sasa obina uko kampo, unalipi ya mtoto school fees na ya kukazi. Who is fooling who here? Nanya na beba mungine ufala? No, 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 wait. In Mombasa, you gone to solve issues. Yes. You are in the same hotel. Mm-hmm. Same room. Mm-hmm. Did you... No. Ata kitu apata, sema no. So you did not? Mm-hmm. Mulilala tu? Ay, nikona infection. Or oh, you told sense. him you have an infection. Mm -hmm. And then you fall asleep, he opens the phone. Mm -hmm. Start seeing other conversations. Okay? So now he wants the phone. Mm -hmm. You're like, Uliona Kitu, it will hurt you. Exactly. So ni kamambia, simu ni yangu, nili nunuwa na pesa yangu. Kama ingekuwa nuhu, li nunuwa hii simu, ingekupea. Okay. Ni kamambia for the past five years, tumekana wewe, I've never had you for your phone. So today it's my phone. Kamambia boss, kupei. Did you used to ask you for your phone before? He's never asked me for my phone. This was the first time. Na hajai ni nuwa simu. Sasa na itisha hafa nye nini. Ni kakata. Uwe. Ushe nyongwa. Stop describing it like that. So you refused your phone? Eh. Ni kamambia i phone si mpe. It wasn't this phone. So what was the phone apple? Umsi ali ni nyonga. Aka kushika. Eh, for real. Aka ni nyonga di ni kono na vitu ziki wa white. So ni kono umsi hata ni uwa. Ni kambia shika phone. Ni kambia hata password. Jata ni kweke. Ni kambia ni kambia sawa go on. Aka ni ambia na usi ya muke hapo. Kenda haka funga mlango juu na chini. You are still in the bed seater? Yes. Kwa ni for five years this guy didn't progress in life? Apana. Life yake ni complicated. Okay. Sasa ni kajua hapa. Kimeumana. Kimeumana. Nikenda jikoni, nikachukua kisu, nikatupa huko inje ya dirisha. Because now I could see. This is all going to end up. He's locked the doors you are in the house. Eh. Na ajafunga na padlock, amafunga tu juu na chini. You decided to go to the kitchen, chukua kisu, throw outside. Fork zote, uko juu. Fork outside. Let's remain on ground. Yes, nga kuja nikakaa chini. Nga ambia baize niko na njaa. So she nikabai mazua, aa, kaa hapo. So nikakaa. Uh -huh. All this time, I'm a screenshot conversation. So, I'm a screenshot Wait, is a conversation. You said something. Actually, you told him you are hungry, you want to go buy milk. Eh. I'm like, wake up, I'm going to go buy milk. Uh huh. Screenshotting, sending. Screenshotting, sending. I'm going to send it to my family group. We have a family group. We're going to post these conversations. He's screenshotting your conversations with another man. Yes. He's sending to your family group. Mm. And then I can text the guy, I can say, oh, when, when do you have a baby? I can say, I thought she moved on. She moved on way long ago. Then I can say, now you know. 
So, one of my aunts are kaona. Oko like, okay, what is not happening? So, yo, asha nyonga simiangu. No call can go through. So, now they tell my mom, piga simu. So, my mom calls. Akamuliza. Should I copy Masiana cheat? A Kamuliza says in the Omejo Masiana cheat. Who may cheat how many years a Kikuvumilia? How many times Umem Chapa Kikuvumilia? So, come on, I cheat. So, watch your end. Tiapana, I want my five years back. Nataka Pesayote and Shai spend quake. Nataka Nani pay your sim. Come here, Sawa. Piggy Sabun, Pesangapi to twenty K check to Kumen and North Rift, Sayama to Kupen and Pesa. Pana. I want the phone. So you call simu bus mfungulia blango? No. Pea masi simu. I'm given the phone. My mama ko like, tuambie uko api, tupe direction tu peke aki. So your parents, your mom didn't know where your boyfriend was living? No, no one knew where we were living by that time. You took out shahama. Acha ni kuambia. Wana semanga no suna. Ama ini kwanga aji yo English. You stop making me laugh. <laughs> no sooner. <laughs> no sooner had I started had giving I started directions. Giving. Than. Nahonga than. Yes. No sooner when had I. Um say I look left handed. You know, your lefties are sharpshooters. They don't miss. Me na kumbi ili kushu ali ni gonga. Phone ili angu kuhuko. Manze ni leona kifo na macho that day. You are still on phone. You are giving your mom directions. Ni le mambe atu tunaishi place flani. Coffee pa. Abu na mpya darafu na kujia fanya ni ni apa. Unadhani ni hawa wata kusewe? Unadhani mse alinigonga kofi. Alinigonga. O mse aliniunda. The last thing nakumboka alininyonga to a point that now everything was white. And now I could see myself die. Ni wana baithe sayi nakufa sasa. You are not screaming? Una scream wapi. Baithe tulikuwa tunaishi on compound. Kwe tu kwa landlord and a neighbor. So all this time ni bango alikuwa nasikia yu commotion. Niki scream akikuja anasikia kumenyamaza. So niki scream ananinyonga. So sizi ongea. So finally what he did, aliniambia kaa wea ni mjanja, toka uende. Manze uo mse asha kunyonga, hauna hata inajia kutoka inje yu mlango. So what do I do? Mini lika. Nika mwona, kise uo nika mwona kenda kitchen. Sijo likuwa ntafta nini. I think niyo kisu, akakosa. Nikona meingia bathroom, kashimla saa bafu aneza chukua nini. Gesa likuja na nini. Nuna ile sister, ile sister ni acho. See, it has that... Sink. Ile, ocha na sink. The sister ni ile... Oh, the kifuniko, the... The kifuniko. It is ceramic. Ii. Ii onde alikuja nayo. The one that looks like this? Yes. That is what he came with. From the toilet? Yes. Ehe? Alinigonga hapa. Venye nilikato hapa na hapa, I can't even explain. So you are seated down? Yes. On the bed, you are tired, you've been choked? Niko ni meka hapa kwa kiti. Mini nisikia tu. Una skingeli di zemi sana sema na una stars, mi ni leo na hizo stars. Damu iliku ina splashi ya hivi. Hizo pieces moja kwa angu kwa gonga TV zingi na zikang kwa zika pa vunji kwa vunji kwenye tu pieces. Sayo sasa ni shanga angu kani kuchini. Ameshika pieces hivi anataka kuni dunga sasa. So ili tayari mimi ni kile hivi damu ika splash once. So ika mcha pa uso. I think ali freak out sasa. Akani yokota akani kile kwa kiti. Alikuwa na shake. Paka I could feel his hands. Alikuwa na shake. Manze ni likuwa na kufa. Nikuwa nambia tu God ka ni leo sawa. Akaenda, haka nambia, can you give me that shirt? Ata nguvia kwa mka atu wapo kufanya hivi hauna. Kachukwa shirt ya kachencha. Kenda kwa bafu waka na wamikono. Wait, he's going at you. You are bleeding. Anataka ni mpe shirt. You are near death. Give me that shirt. He's thinking of changing his look. Yes. Sana nataka kuenda. Na ali left. Ali left, haka niya chapo. Bleeding? Yes. Hapa? Inyama iliko imehangi wote hivi. Venye nilitoka kwa iyo hao, hadi kwa niba. Manze, I don't know. Alafu uyo ni bangu wali kwa nituwa kama mimi. And she was, she was I think two months. Not even two weeks. Ali kwa metoka kudeliver, she was two weeks old. That mama was going nuts. Ana shindi watanifanya nini? Ushe ichapo adi nguzi kararuka. Zile nguo ni nguo nazo zili kwa zisha raruka. So, haka nituwa hizo nguo, haka nivalisha nguo zake. She came with a cotton nula, haka niyekele hapa. 
she called the husband her call the, was not even there come call like amambia ni ba amechapwa i need to get her to the hospital kumbe huyo msee ameenda ame call best yake akamwambia manze ni memes ende umwangalia koko kwa nyumba huyu naye kukuja ati wapi ile phone amesema ameacha hapa so like mimi unanipeleka usia mbona niuliza simu nikamwambia kama oh madam akanuzwa pe phone yako nikamwambia koko kwa nyumba nikamwambia phone imenyongwa akatoa divert that time my family was calling everyone was calling they really wanted to know what went down because the last thing mama ngwa lisikia lisikia ni scream so now they would take me to a certain hospital na huko rongai kufika wanauliza mna mjua ni ni bwangu so they ask we need a down payment how much is it 10k so the only thing one is afanya ni one dunge tu shindano ni acheku bleed that is the only thing they did so ni baka sema before the family comes what i mean is mamia so she gives out the 10000 akapelekwa theater kana nikashonwa so you are akati ya kushonwa doka ko like wait kuna mali pengine una bleed ko like ebu angalia hapa so we find this car then we find the one okay like one mse alikuwa anataka kukuama ni nini so nikamaliziwa nikaenda i find my my aunt alikuwa amesha kam So tunauliza so then the boss alikuwa amekuja boss wao mseal kwa amekuja the mom was there wananiuliza kwa nini kumeenda aje so my aunt anauliza mnalipa bila mom lipi uko like hatuna pesa sawa mmekuja kufanya they leave so tukalipa bill bill kalipwa tukaenda tukaandikiwa form tukaenda karao nikachukua hiyo p3 tukaenda nayo so nikana nikamwambia my aunt we need to go back to that house cuz ile bag nilikuwa nayo ilikuwa na documents zangu nilikuwa nishazichukua nilikuwa nimeka hapo tukaenda tukachukua nikaeka nikamwambia i wanted to go and niko kuna place specific nilikuwa nataka kwenda kukaa nikamwambia nipeleke kwa ubesh tangu ndio iko at least near hospital jo hizo hiyo could receive and everything so we go there manze i didn't know kuna siku moja itafika ati nitoshwa kama mtoto But there oh dem But there oh her lord she didn't find anything I don't even know how I can Yes I'm thank Oh dem alikuwa ananiosha come to you How's girl wake alikuwa ananitan I couldn't turn singeza as in kutani hivi usiku ni akuja nishike kichwa anitan cuz wezi move mwili ilikuwa uchungu nilikuwa naamka asubuhi leo nimefurahi side naamka the next day nimefurahi side nimekuwa mdark sasa hapo ndo nasikia anga character development self esteem yangu ilishuka once one morning niliamka nikamwambia nikamwambia Dorin nipeleke pale kwa kio so akakuja akanipika akanipeleka hapo kwa i used to sleep kwa, kwa, kwa sitting room yake kwa floor i couldn't do a bed cuz ile pin nilikuwa nayo nikana nikajangalia kwa kio niko like wa in the name of love niko like sawa tu That is a day depression ilianza kunitandika. Manze nilikuwa nafikiria vitu mob. I was thinking how am I going even to explain to my son what happened? You know dukitu ilikuwa inani hit. So my mom comes. Ah watu wameniweka pressure twende ujaziwe hiki tu kwa ofisi ya gava. I mean like mom I'm not doing this. I I wasn't ready for that because mimi nilikuwa najua definitely my family wako na pesa. So nilikuwa najua huyu mtu kamiti anaenda. So nilikuwa na picha ile picha ya mimi hapa na Dylan wangu kamiti tumeenda kumuona. What am I even doing to my son? Uh, and I deserve you. My son didn't deserve all that nonsense. So nikajua the only thing niko nayo you you've tortured me physically me I'm going to torture you psychologically. Na nikasema wherever utaenda na nika make sure ameju na nikamwambia sikiza hapa bro. Mimi nitakutocha mentally utaishi kunikumbuka. Jamaa ukumbe alienda kujiua alikuwa na kotwa na huko kiseria ako na best yake ana konga karao i think walimtra kwa kampata so after hapo nikarudi shule so hiyo ilikuwa march exam iko april na kwambia ubina nilikuwa nashika hivi book nothing nothing hakuna kitu ningesoma hivi ni understand making matters worse mabest wangu wako like kwani ulinyoa nyoele cuz siezi to amavin niko na bande japa wizi to ayo mavin so wako like mbona utuangi iko fia so one time ni mengi hivi class someone akai snatch hivi akaitoa and everybody saw i have a bandage and everybody was like wow when what happened mzee hiyo kitu ilini crash ilini crash totally 
nikachukua i didn't even attend class that day nilitoka nikaisha because everybody was asking me well, how do you even start explaining to people what happened i didn't have that energy ya kuambia watu this happened this happened so nikaisha tu so that time sikuwa na lala the whole of 2018 sikuwa ilala hivi kufunga macho i did mpaka around around september if come i had this weird migraine ilikuwa too painful wezi lala wezi fanya anything so ikafika place ika ikakuwa ikakuwa intense nilikuwa ni kama na cheese so nilikuwa jaribu kuangalia hivi sioni juu vile unao mwana kichwa so nikena nikena kenyata i saw a certain neurosurgeon akanipatia dawa akanambia you need to eat and you need to go and sleep akanambia you trust me you let us kutatu so nikaenda akapewa dawa nikaenda home that is your time sana ilikuwa tacho but it time when you do shule mwanzo siku siku na lala ulikuwa unafunga hivi macho unamuona ndio huyu anakaa kitu ilinisumbua ilinisumbua for the longest time kampo ikaisha jamaa kenda missing tukachana naye pia tukakosana life ikasonga you close your eyes you see him ulikuwa unafunga hivi macho unamuona ndio huyu ana kwanza ile part alikuwa ngamenikelea that piece and ilikuwa imevunjika that thing ilikuwa ina ni freak out Niko na nifu. Afu yote mkumke bado niko na bandage. Ndio hizi exam. Manzi mimi nakumkanga my last exam nilinganga tu hivi nikaandika admission number yangu na nikaka. Ninaandika nini? I have no idea. Wezi soma unless sasa niende nikaichini vile tunapiga story na wewe hivi. That is only thing that will sink into my head. But kushika hivi book ilikata. So did you ever finish school? Manzi nilipita nilikuwa na second hapa. Nilipita vibaya sana. With all the damages. Mm. Now if you didn't have them I need get a first class by the way. Cuz kampona yani nilisoma me I had one agenda in life. Me my mom is a single mom. Bukango amenisomesha all along and me I had one agenda making this man proud. Me ni joy fucked up everything nika nikapata ball his I'm, I'm his best grandchild cuz me ndo kwanza. So so mzee ameshikuniona kama star. So I knew nime kuna mali nime fail and I need I needed to make him proud. So nilikuwa sure I have to do this. And that man was happy by the way. He did. He was very happy. So currently what are you doing? I'm a HR. Okay. No akuku parklands. Okay. Your boyfriend, your toxic boyfriend. Where is he? He's in Rongai. And the worst part about all this shit, my son hajai heal. Paka wale hoy. Huh? My son has never healed from all these things. He talks about it every single day. Na hakuwa hapo. Hii ni story alikuwa nasikia tu huko. The day he came asking me, "Mom, ulifanya nini hapa?" Nilimwambia nilianguka kwa shule nikingkwa shule mama mimi najua. Sasa baba alikuchapa. Mwanzeni niliangalia yule mtu wangu nikasema wa. Ilibidi mtu wangu aende home. Get kwanza getting him kutoka huko tu kitu ya kwanza it was hell. Walikatadi na mtu hii. Nimeenda hadi shule kwa na mtu hii. I have no access to my son. Mtoto wangu mimi nimezaa ubina siezi muona. So siku moja I don't know. Tu hii ni mambo ya God tu. Mtu yule amka siku moja akasema nataka mama na akujisai so I was called mtu yeye anataka kuongea na akamwambia mama nikujia Yo time nilikuwa job fulani molo nilitoka molo nikakuja hadi Rongai nikachukua mtu yeye akaniambia unajua nini mama nataka kwenda ushago That night obina huo mtoto alienda ushago niliekwa call niliekwa hivi kwa simu nikamwambia this is your son talking Mtu yeye alikuwa na rap anapeana storyline utadhani alikuwa hapo Aliongea so much na after hapo ali shut down and that is how messed up he became sasa hizi mtu wangu anaona anga mwanaume ananikelelesha hivi atakutusi he gets so agitated and I'm furious ako na asira ingine so bad my family has tried everybody especially my guka and my shosh they have and my mom who I try we are really trying to make sure hiyo anga inashuka but imekata he's just messed up so me or any any guy i meet me i have a kid from a toxic relationship so how you handle me tread carefully cuz ukimonyesha unanikelelesha atakuchukia na kuchukia milele it has not be easy for him i don't know what we're going to do juzi nilimwambia kuja muone wa talk najua mtu yeye alikataa alikataa na kakataa na kakataa na kakataa eventually tukam sweet talk akamuliza saa umekuja umeniletea nini hakuna saa umekuja kudu That is what he asked him and he he felt so bad ni kambia that is it this is your son this is what you did we have nothing to talk about so juzi alikuwa anasema ati anataka turudiane turudiane tufanye aniue sasa 
we have no business. He wanted us to talk about the talk about what? Mto hii toka azaliwa ni wapi amelipa school fees? Hata anajua anaendanga shule gari hata anajua size yake tu peke yake. Hata tu ile tu ujifanye mbaba mzuri ukuje umwambie baby ndo hii baby shika bike. Mapi? Haizi. Haizi. What does your mom say? Do I let her talk that they were happy but my mom she's never been she regrets by the way cuz I feel she 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 really told me to when she kicked you out it's like she had a hand in the but whole she, she really uh, oh, and I regret sana but at some point I could just apologize can I be she sorry my dear um, I apologize uh, there is no amount of sorries I can say for what you went through I feel your pain and uh, there's a girl who is watching now the lady who is in a toxic relationship and they're thinking the guy will change there's a guy who is in a to toxic relationship and is thinking the lady will change look at this camera what are you telling them a man will never change the first thing you, it is you who changes who fit kwa viatu yake so the moment unaona huu msee imeanza na hiyo coffee it doesn't matter nini you may invest hapo toka uende it is the best thing you, you could do for yourself cuz ukika hapo mzee this mark hajaisha i'm not even planning to do anything it okay hapa it's permanent and this is a lesson well learned so value yourself jipende sana self love is more important than kuka hapo unapenda mtu unampenda ni brother kwa mata kwa wenyu hizi kwa wenyu ana ku hurt tu so just love yourself that is it that was an episode of Toxic Boyfriends. If you've happened to be in a similar situation, worse than this one, at least better, moderate, come, let's sit down, let's talk about it so we can create the awareness so that at least we start having healthy relationships out there so people should not think that when they get their bare minimum, that is the best that is out there or the best that is to be offered. Let's talk about it so ladies and also men can be able to see the red flags early in a relationship so you can avoid this. So what if she died? She has... You say 40? How many stitches? 42. 42 stitches. What if she died? Who would be there with the baby? So let's talk about it and see how it goes. Our email is on the screen. Do the necessary. Also leave a comment in the comment section. And tell someone to subscribe because you need to watch this channel. You need it. My dear, thank you for Welcome. coming. Pole. Ntako nifanya ni kwe emotional hapa. His life. Eh? We. His life. We, 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 we. So you still talk to him? Ako block list. Hata juzi ni limambia mtoto wako Mombasa. So anangoja ada. Luza kwa ni mtoto wako toki Mombasa. So what does he want to do? He wants to see the child and then? Anitaka ni mpe mtoi wakene. Wanakane ya mpiki ya mkule ya mamfanya nini? Doesn't work. Kama iwaki work. Don't force issues. Tumekuwa na yewe five years. It's been four years. All of a sudden ni mekurumia, ni mekupea mtoto. Nothing. Sunitisha fee structure. Unginitisha sunitisha fee structure ya kwanza venya lenga shule kwanza. Unirefund hizo pesa. Hato ukinirefund as in SID. The damage is done. Mtoto wangu wa Jay Hill. So, what do we do? Kunyo for you, mami. Kunyo for you. Ah, na, si. Si mumu. Mami changanya hapa, una ni confused. You know, for you, and then I'll also give you one so you carry. Kifika nyumbani upige kitu. Asante. Let's leave it there. This story. Bye.